In this tutorial video, I'm going to show you how to read the chart dashboard. The dashboard gives you lots of data on your charts. As you can see, you can quickly view all of your charts that you've ever created. You can edit them by clicking this edit button, or you can delete the charts altogether. Of course, you have the chart name, which you can edit as well. But the really valuable information is the views clicks and click through rate. So you can see how many times this chart has been viewed live on your website, 149 times in this particular case. And I can see that five people have clicked on the chart itself. And this is just on a test page, so that's why it's pretty low. In fact, all of these are basically on test pages. Uh, but I can see that I've gotten five clicks. That equates to a 3.36% click through rate uh, that's what CTR stands for. And then these other columns, EPC and earnings, are actually up to you to input data so that that calculates correctly. And I will go into that into a future field, but basically you can in a future video, but you can input anything that you want in the EPC field. So if you feel like you're earning $1 uh, and 10 cents per click, you can change that and that would show you how much you've earned from that particular chart. And you can get more information in your Amazon Associates account to see how much your average click is valued at. Uh, you just log into your Amazon Associates account, uh, calculate how much you've made and how many clicks you've received through that particular tracking ID. And then you can just input your EPC or your earnings per click here in this field. So that's how you can read the chart dashboard overall. It really is a lot of very, very valuable information uh, because once you know how many times it's been viewed and how many clicks you're getting, you can then go in and start to tweak that to see if you can get even more clicks for the same number of views and thus increasing your earnings overall. 